I'm on a mission to get myself a fire cape within 45 days of membership with one major catch. I'm not allowed to play for more than an hour each day. I'm going to have to find ways to circumvent many of RuneScape's grinds in order to achieve my goal on time. Things like spending hours at Sandcrabs simply isn't viable, and every day the clock ticks closer and closer to when we have to face Jad. Is this even a possible goal, considering I'm generally pretty bad at the game to begin with? How do I use a grand exchange, and all my experience in-game comes from playing Iron Man? Will I lose my sanity or hair during this process? Find out in today's episode of One Hour Limit Locked. Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, wherever you are, wherever you are, whatever the time may be, welcome back to the series. We are about to kick off day 35 here. I'm chilling today. It's going to be a super chill day. My plan is to kill some green dragons. I just have no worries right now. We got our blow fight yesterday, you know? We got 10 days left to get ourselves a fire cape. 11 hours, including today. 11 days, technically, including this session. So, like, you know, we, we're good. We're good. We need two range levels. That's it. We need two range levels and an inventory, which we can mainly buy with the cannon, but... Uh, it would be nice to have a little bit of extra cash because we are broke as a bitch at the minute. So yeah, I'm going to be chilling at Green Dragons. I'm going to be stacking up bones. And I think the next goal is going to be aiming for that 70 prayer along with the 75 ranged. So I'm going to spend a fairly solid day like trying to be at drags as much as I can and see how much ranged XP we get and how long I think it would take me to get both the buns that I want for the prior level and the ranged XP for the range level if I was just doing that. If it's going to be good enough or if I need to do something else for quicker ranged XP to bust those levels out. Today is sort of going to be a, a test of that. But before we do, I do have a hard clue and the first step is very easy so I'm going to go do it at the start of the day. Uh, I put myself back at the GE but didn't do anything else after getting the screenshot yesterday for the thumbnail so that's where we're going to be sat and yeah let's get on into it i'm actually going to remember to hit the time of today i promise here we go oh look at that blowpipe it's so sexy it's so sexy all right we're just going to see if we can get a caterby teleport i'm pretty sure we can yeah they're not that expensive nice okay get the clue Okay, travel to the fairy ring to see where to dig, CKP, where actually is it, because I can't, fairy ring, where's the, oh is that like, um, fuck, CKP, is that a different realm, yeah it's the cosmic entity, I can't do that, I can't do that step at all, okay, well that was a waste of time, don't really want to be in the full blast, at all, ah, uh, anti-fire, cannon parts, a bit of food. Cannonballs? Yes. Looting bag. I think we're good to go. If we're not, we'll find out. Let's just get a reset. Yeah, we lost a few minutes at the start of the day, but the rest of the day I'm just going to be, like, pretty steady at green drugs. See how much ranged XP we can rack up. Right now, we're just on the cusp of 73, so... We're at 1 million and 2,000 XP. Alright. Let the fun begin. Almost done on the first trip. It's been pretty chill. Got 50k ranged XP an hour, looking like. Didn't just run out of energy though. Only brought a single stamina though, so with me, so. Probably should have had more. But yeah, it's looking to be roughly 50k an hour XP in the range department, which would mean we're at like two days for a level. Four days for the two levels that we need. Which still leaves us plenty of time. And should get us most of the buns that we need for prayer as well. If not all. But I'm going to have spare time that I, I don't currently have a plan for. So I'm going to have to get my thinking cap on. Oh, there's a hard clue. Do I even... I'll just check it. Yeah, I don't, even, I don't even know what that one is, so... Yeah, I kind of need to, to figure out a plan of something else to do. To 
make use of the empty space. Maybe like defense or hit points levels are the two areas I'm thinking we could we could do with a boost in that regard, potentially. I don't know. I have to think about it. But once I've thought about it and figured out what else I want to be doing, I can sort of sprinkle that in so that we're not just spending the next four days or five days at Green Drags. So we can do some different stuff. But yeah, we're very on pace for where we want to be. Basically just killing these on cooldown at the minute. Actually got them in a really nice rotation. It's like a 15 second respawn timer. So if they take like... Oh, it's 18 seconds even. So if it's a 6 second kill, then... We get one down by the time the next one comes up. We'll just slow down a bit though. This was a super fast trip. I felt like it anyway. Fucking Captain Arav. Why do I get the worst random events when I do get them? Oh. Uh, you can't tap me, that's fun. So we need a range potion and a burning amulet and food. Yeah. Another clue scroll. We get a lot of hard clues from these guys. Okay, that one couldn't be easier, literally. Like, that is literally a 30 second step, so there's no way I'm not doing it. Can't tell if the trips are getting quicker or if my timekeeping's getting worse. There is another one down. XP rate slightly down now that we've had a couple of trips to the bank and back. Okay, let's go do the step actually. It's real simple. Do we have any Lumbridge teleports? No. I guess we'll home telly. It's quicker than going GE and buying one. Okay. Inside Karamja Volcano. Well, we can do that. I don't have a jeweling ring on me. We can do it. We can do it. I should do it. I'm just going to make sure I have everything I need to go back to the dragons. I feel I, I'm actually, this might be dumb, but I'm going to go back to the dragons and just loot what's there on the floor because I, I feel like I'm losing shit if I don't. I might reload the cannon, I don't know. Because this won't take us that long. See, there's just three bones and dragon hides on the floor waiting for us. How could we not? Well, they're probably all low as well, so... Okay, we're going to finish the ones that were alive when I got here, not the one that respawns. Oh, that one's even higher. Okay, I guess we'll just finish this one because it's low now. Did I just get sucked into another trip? No, I haven't pod. It's all good. Right, it's not going to take as long to do this, so I'm going to go to Karamja. And we got half a living bag, so I feel like it was worth the teleport charge to just go pick up the shit that the cannon had done. Because there'll be another half of an invent waiting for us when we get back again. Look at me turning my clues from completely inefficient to uh, still doing things. Oh, that is such an easy step as well. Are we actually getting lucky on our hard clue? Okay, so we will bank everything and then get some energy. Go back out, pick up our free loot, reset the cannon. The XB rate is dipping, but we're actually completing steps on a hard clue. Trying not to get my hopes up. Let's see how low this one is. Okay, it's gonna run out in two minutes anyway, but we'll be back by then. So let's get on out of here. And our only real way to get to Ardy is with the lever. Which does mean it's a bit of a run from here, but not too bad. Literally the same step again. Okay. This is step number four on this clue. Four kills on the floor. Don't mind if I do. This feels like cheating, honestly. Just leaving the cannon here. It's getting us kills. We come back and get free kill, free loot. Then we go do a clue step. Feels like cheating. I didn't bring my spade, though. 
I believe four steps is the minimum amount that it could possibly be. <laughs> Somewhat nice. I'll take that, 160k, I'll take 160k, I'll take 160k every day. Let's go, we finally completed a hard clue, y'all. And we didn't, like, waste that much time from killing our drags to do it, which is very nice indeed. I am very low on cannonballs, I think I should probably go GE, but I'll do it after the trip, because I haven't actually made a trip in a while. After saying I was going to have a nice chill day spending it entirely at Green Drugs. XP rate's gone down to 50k an hour. We forgot to get a reset. That's fantastic. Yeah, gone down from 50 to 40k on the XP rate, but that's to be expected. We've been not here. Look at all the loot that's just waiting there. Five loots on the floor. Just waiting for us to pick them up. There's another one done. I feel like we're gonna have a lot of kills today. We did have like 30 dragon hide to start out though, so it's worth noting. That's usually how I track how many kills I've done for the day, but we did have like 30 something to start out. That I didn't sell from yesterday. Okay, I really need cannonballs. Do I even have money though? I haven't sold anything. I'll do for now. Don't actually have any purple teleports on me right now. Not ideal, but what is ideal is coming back to an insult dragon ahead, two almost dead dragons, and two sets of bones on the floor. Oh, I didn't even pot this trip. My clicks are all over the place. And that's another trip done. I'm adding to my marked tile collection this purple tile between the blue and the red one. That is a safe tile from both of those. We're expanding our tile bit database, y'all. Another trip down. Another trip done. I'm not going to make the next one like a full length trip. It's just going to be sort of a couple of minutes, get a bit of loot, make sure we have a good few minutes still to spend at the GE. We've done pretty well for ourselves today though. I don't know if I need anything else. No, that's good. Look at all the free stuff. Oh gosh, there is a system update today. It's a good job that didn't turn up like a minute into the recording. Would have been awkward. Okay, I think I'm gonna call it that. Uh... I'll just kill this one. Alright, let's get ourselves a reset so we don't forget tomorrow. Only got a minute, but should be able to get some stuff slapped up onto the GE at least. <laughs> 216 Dragonite. Like I said, we had about 30, so it's not 100% accurate. But yeah, look at that fucking invent. Absolutely full. Let's get the Dragonite up there, the most important part, aren't they? Get the Zami page and the purple sweets up. Need to consolidate our nature runes. Get it heads up, get some rune daggers up. That's about all we have time for. Alrighty then. I uh, cash stack's still looking miserable. I'm gonna leave all this shit in my invent so that I can get it all on there tomorrow. Cash stack still looking very miserable, just 76k. However, we've got about 500k in the GE, assuming this green dragon hide sells, that's a lot of it. These purple sweets will sell eventually as well. They're worth a lot. And what have we got in our invent? Let's see. About 160k 
including the cash stack that we already have. So we're, we're up to about 650k again, which isn't bad considering we just like shelled out on the blowpipe yesterday. And we don't have a great deal of use for cash outside of like we need to buy our invent. There's nothing else particularly that I'm, I'm desperate for cash for. And I feel like we'll be pretty good in that regard. It's just keeping these cannonballs topped up is something we need to make sure we're doing. But yeah, we got up to 780 dragon bones today. I think we killed about 190 dragons maybe. Pretty decent solid day. We also did a hard clue, which I'm genuinely shocked that we managed to get one done. But that's cool. A solid day. A solid day of progress. I'm not sure what more to say than that. Why have I got four emerald rings? Where have I even got them from? Anyway, we'll take a little look at the XP. We gained about 40k today. 37,000 XP, so not that great. And I'm wondering if the, the green drags are not going to be quick enough ranged XP to get me there in a decent amount of time. So I feel like we might be doing something else with some ranged XP. Maybe we can put some of that money to use on some chin chompers and go and get some bonus levels that way i don't know maybe we go back to scurious i haven't figured it out entirely yet but we've still got about uh if we're on one mil 40 and we're trying to get to 75 we've got about 150 no 170,000 xp to go so at 40k a day it's still quite a while like we're not even one level every two days there. We'll have to figure that out. Let's see how much prayer XP we've got banked now. I think we had 62 levels yesterday. Today we're up to 65, so we're making solid, solid progress. Another couple days of that and we'll have enough for the 70 prayer that is the dream goal. Yeah, solid day, folks. Let me know in the comments if you have any ideas or what I should do with my spare bits of time things that you think might be good upgrades going into the fight caves maybe it's something i've overlooked who knows if not i'll probably be making some money in whatever way possible and using that to buy some even further upgrades who knows maybe we get an archer's ring or a brimstone or a fury or i don't know Just want to shout out all the people who've been subscribing recently. Thank you so much. We're almost at 200 subscribers now. We may well be by the time this comes out or a day or two after it. Whenever you're watching it, we may be. But right now it's 195 as I'm recording this and it's been rising. So thank you for everyone who's subscribing. Make sure you do hit that sub button if you haven't already so that you stay up to date when all my new videos come out because I'm a mad bastard and I post a video every single day at the minute. And leave a like on the video because it helps out a ton. Other than that, look after yourself, be lovely to one another, and I will see you on the next one.